at the Holistic Grazing Management event. Juliet, where are you from? Hi, Shelley. Um, I'm from Tumbarumba, um, down on the Gingelic side. Um, I've got a small farm where I run crossbred ewes and grow super premium wine grapes. Awesome. And we've just been listening to Graham Hand, yeah. um, a consultant in holistic grazing management. What's one of the key messages you've taken from today? I think to have a go. Yeah. Um, it's okay to fail, yep. um, but go do a small patch. Yep. Um, act, don't overthink it. Um, have a go because if you keep doing the same old things you'll get the same old result so if you're going to make change have the courage get some backup with people like NutriSoil um, and see how it goes monitor it so be scientific about it yep. what I like about this is that it's based in science it's practical I think Graham has has walked the walk yep. and so um, I'm going to go home and actually in, increase the density of my sheep flock and then measure what that does to my awesome. paddock species. Well, good luck. Thank you. <laughs> Hi, Shelley here um, in Brungle at the special event uh, put on by NutriSoil. I'm with Scott. Scott, where are you from? I'm from Dallo, about 20 minutes further down the road from here. No worries. And what's the key message you got out of today's event? Uh, pretty much just changing uh, farming practices to suit your soils and to suit your ground cover to uh, make it last longer throughout the season. Very good. Thanks for coming. Thank you. Okay, I'm with Anthony now. Anthony, where are you from? Uh, I'm from Lismore, uh, up in northern New South Wales, and I'm a student studying regenerative agriculture at uni. So we've just finished up with Graham Hand and the day. What was one of the key messages you will take home? Uh, I, I, it was very interesting, and one of the key messages is that the intensity of the stock is a really important factor and that for his system that low grazing or high grazing yep. is really important. So grazing right down but having long recoveries. Yeah, yep. long recoveries, yeah. Yep. Excellent, fantastic, thanks for coming. Thank you. I'm with Peter. Peter, where are you from? Wagga, uh, or the farms near Aura, um, oh. right just outside of Wagga. Very good, and what are you farming? Uh, we've got uh, ewes and fat lambs and we've got cows and calves and we also do trade steers or heifers, one of yep. our And what was one of the key messages we got from today? Uh, I think one of the key messages was the um, trialling yep. that, that Graham was recommending and making sure that um, uh, you do a lot of them and that you um, convince yourself through action. Yep. Yeah. Uh, which I think is a really good message, and so um, that's yep. it. Yep. And also, um, I think just uh, the way that uh, he grazes and um, recovery time yep. is a little bit different than I've heard from a couple of other areas, but it makes good sense. From the inside looking out And he's from the outside like a tall bean sprout What are you, what are you to release our fears? Taking on a new decade Shaking off some passage, it's a hard thing